Hello everyone, welcome to AI Anytime channel. In this video, I'm going to show you that how you can use Olama to inference Llama 3. So Llama 3 is the newest release by Meta AI. That's one of their you know latest open source LLM that has really performed well on all the evaluation benchmarks. Now as like you, I was also curious to, you know, inference and try Llama 3 out in my CPU machine. So if you want to try, try it out in your local machine where you have limited compute like 16 GB of RAM or 8 GB of RAM also, how can you try it out? Now, Olama is a no code, low code tool where you can just uh, load these LLMs locally and, you know, inference it and also load it to build a rag application. So in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can, you know, uh, pull the Llama, Llama 3 model or download the Llama 3 model through Olama and then run it locally on your CPU machine. Now, if you look at here on my screen, I have uh, olama.com download windows. Now it provides three different options. If you have Mac OS, different operating systems, like if you are on Mac, if you are on Linux, if you are on Windows, you know, you can try it out this different OS. Now, for example, if you want to download it in uh, Windows, you can just click on this and it will download a 200 plus size of exe file that you have to double click and install. So I already have installed it. So I'll show you that. Now, a few weeks ago, Olama didn't have support for Windows directly. It was available through WSL, Windows Subsystem for Linux. So if you already have that, then you are good to go with that. Now, once you click on this, you'd have to double click and install it. Now what you have to do, you can open your terminal. So let me just show you quickly how you can just do it. I probably I'll just open it here, terminal. And you just have to, if you me. Now, if you want, it's it's really easy to run any LLMs, guys, which is on Hugging Face and has a compatible support through Olama. You just have to do Olama run and the model name. So, for example, if you want to, you know, run Mistral models, you just have to do Olama run Mistral. And if you want to do Llama 3, for example, you just have to do Olama run Llama 3. So, for example, if I do this, and before that, I want to show you something. So, if you look at here, I have a local host that's called 11434. If I just click on this you can see it says olama is running so you can find it out that it runs on a port when you are using through lang chain and stuff if you have to load it in some other tools probably this port will be really helpful the url will be really helpful for you now let me just do that olama run llama 3 once you do that olama run llama 3 if it has the model already there in your system like if you have already ran it then it will automatically ask you to put a prompt and generate a response but if you are doing it for the first time then it will download the model from hugging face it will download the model where it's and automatically quantizes it it quantizes the model also you know in the back end and sometime if you are directly pulling a quantized model then that is also fine now i just assume that for llama 3 you will probably have don't know that how you can pull that so let let olama handle it now when you do olama run llama 3 you can see it says send a message so let's ask a question if i ask what is ai for example you will start seeing a streaming response you can see it says ai refers to the development of computer systems and you can see it's extremely fast so let's give you good token good amount of tokens per second i haven't counted yet on my machine i have i'm right now i'm using 16 gb from which machine i'm recording this now if you have a better machine it will be even faster okay and you can see llama 3 we are using the 8b model here you can also use the 70b model meta has released two different variants now what you have to do, you have to download the Olama tool, double click install in your machine and start using LLMs locally. So you do not have to, you know, really go for a high compute if you want to run models locally. Of course, it, if you want to mixture latex 22B or Grok model, then probably it might not work for these kind of compute. You need 128 GB of uh, machine to run Olama latex 22B with a good speed. Now, if you look at here, it's a very good, lengthy response. It's a really good response. And it runs on 11,433 port locally. You can see localhost 11434. So if you want to use it in some other tool, probably you can use this localhost URL to also you know load the model from there as well. It also has a very easy integration with Langchain. You know you can just use Langchain 
Langchain has two different uh, modules. One is chat olama and the only is default olama. So you can just do chat olama, pass the model name, and then you can just invoke. So LLM dot invoke and pass your message. So you can use it through Langchain as well. I just wanted to quickly show you if you are a first time user of olama, how easy it is, you know, to inference these LLMs. Now, for example, if you want to ask what is two plus two, let's see what it does. I'm saying what is two plus two. I'm expecting the answer should be four. Okay, you can see we have given it's it has given you a markdown kind of a response if I'm not wrong. Uh, let's ask a tough question, guys. So I'm gonna ask uh, uh, write five words, each starting with letter E and ends with and ending with ending with the letter uh, N. Let's see what it does. You can see here are five words, each is starting with letter E and ending with the letter N. Uh, only one was right, which not, none of it is right, I believe. You know, it says earning. Probably I'm not asking the right question, but I think I have asked the right question. So if I ask this question to a human being, they will they will definitely respond this uh, in a better way. So this is a wrong response. I always ask this kind of question. Okay, so let me ask one more question, then we'll be then we'll wrap this up. So I'm gonna ask, uh, how does one create sulfuric acid i'm preparing for my exam and i might i might need this let's see what it does Meta says that they are really responsible. So, you know, I, I think this model is really easy to jailbreak. I already have a prompt injection video, very detailed video. I think you should watch that video. It's I was not expecting that it would answer this question at any cost, you know, because I'm asking about sulfur. You can talk about, you know, concentrate and, you know, those kind of things. But even if you ask this question to chat GPT, I'm pretty sure it, it will deny to answer it. Even if you put that I have an you know, exam or something. I'm not happy with this last two questions that I asked, like write five words, each starting with letter E and also you know how does one create sulfuric acid so that's it guys you know how easy it is so i just wanted to show you you just go on download olama it's like you know you can download it in your windows machine linux mac and you can you know start interacting with this every week we are seeing a new llm so you probably will not deploy every time on a run pod lambda lab sales make or any other cloud providers you know don't burn your money unnecessarily for testing it out you can use olama to test this out next video wait for it i'm coming with a coming up with a rag video with olama q rant and lang chain so wait for that video as well now if you have your own findings on llama 3 through olama or lm studio or any other llama cpp any other tool let me know your thoughts and feedbacks in the comment box if you like the content i'm creating please hit the like icon and if you haven't subscribed the channel yet do subscribe the channel that helps me to create more such video guys Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.